swear to God, if Entertainer dies, I'm gonna goddamn lose it. Up, Woody Nerdigans. This is the one only Packer Girl 89. Today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Abyss Rage chapters 55 through 57. So, um, for those of you that don't know, if I do get like extremely emotional um, throughout my videos for a while, it's um, because last night my boyfriend died from a heroin overdose. So, um, uh, it's still really fresh, and if you're wondering why the fuck I'm even doing live reactions right now, um, this was, like, actually the original reason why I did live reactions. It's a therapy for me. It helps, uh, keep my mind, uh, clear. So, um, anyway, uh, I just want to put that out there. Anyway, um, last time I covered Abyss Rage, we were getting into this kick-ass fight with my boy, the Entertainer. I swear to God, if he dies, I'm gonna probably cry a lot harder than I originally would have. <laughs> Even though I would, I would, I would, that, that's pretty hard anyway. But anyway, um, god damn it, I'm probably gonna cry anyway throughout this chapter because the reason why I like the Entertainer was because there's a lot of the shit he'd do what my mans would do. So, anyway, Let's get to uh, chapter 55 and see what happens next. What just happened to me? A severe concussion. A severe concussion. Probably an open-handed strike with both palms. That's Shinobu's technique. He copied that the technique that I copied from Shinobu. I have to focus on recovering. How come Megami uses left arm? I'm certain I broke it. The legend of the strongest lives on. Is he in the flow state? In the zone as described by some athletes? Did something snap awake inside him? Give me a break. You've always been the strongest one, right? Only one thing is crystal clear, that I am currently in a predicament. The nightmare begins once more. And chapter 55 is titled, Why um, You Are Weak. Shit, my legs are refusing to move. I'll have no hope if I um, have to fight in this condition. Th that was Shinobu's technique you just, um, you just uh, used, wasn't it? I've got I've gotten a widen gap between us in order to recover. I'm impressed you can use a move correctly that you've only uh, seen once for the security camera. I've, I've got to stall him for more time by talking and uh, figure out how to bounce back from the damage I've taken. But to think that someone as strong as you would need to steal another school's technique, you got to be kidding. Whoa! I'm screwed. No! 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 You, conti you continue to come out on top simply because you're a genius. Occupied by your own talent, neglecting to make an effort, and yet you want again and again. That is why you are weak. When the balance of victory and defeat tilts even the slightest in your opponent's favor, you lose sight of how to handle it. Failure is a stepping stone to success. Defeat is food for victory. You can't come close to my strength gain from experiencing both the sweetness and bitterness of life. Sorry, guys. I am grateful. No, no, no. You better not, I swear you better not die or I'm going to lose my fucking mind. I'm grateful. Thanks to you prattling on, I was able to gain some time to recover. I'm sorry. That's, that's something Brian would say. I'm sorry. That is something Brian would fucking say. Shuichi Amagami. My name is Megami. Oh, wait. Did I say it wrong? Oh, yeah, okay. My name is Megami. Just Megami. Isn't that right, John? <gasps> no! No, if I give up now, I'm amazed you haven't lost consciousness after being knocked around this much. But now, it's time for Betty Bye, little Toshihide. No, 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 no! No, I've already lost one, man. I ain't losing another right now. Is this really the end? I'm a genius, aren't I? Yink. Exactly. Woo! How impressive! A flying um armbar. His spirit remains unbroken. That's my man right there. Okay, let's get to chapter fifty-six. Oh God, I'm so scared. I'm so scared, fam. Um, I don't believe in tales of the supernatural in this mundane world, not in the least. I don't think there's any such thing as gods or ghosts or monsters either. In my opinion, a hero showing his strength in a, in a tight spot like in the movies belongs entirely to the world of fiction. However, through the extremely condensed yet gently flowing river of time, those memories that are resurrected so vividly in chapter 56 is titled The Path of a Genius. I suppose this is what is meant when uh, they say your life flashes before your eyes at the border between life and death. Another score for Kimijima. He's on fire. He took the shot with his left hand. Um, ambidextrous? That's gotta be a foul. Oh, no, I'm not gonna cry anymore. 
Um, that's enough, Kimishima. You run off with the ball as soon as you get your hands on it. You don't pay attention to instructions either. You know that basketball is a team sport, don't you? Come on, you can tell Timmy straight. It's getting on my nerves seeing you dominate the team just one week after joining. Oh my god, this is so Brian! Brian is my, um, my now dead boyfriend's name. This is so fucking Brian! Damn it, Maka Gods! You're making me think of him now. Um, I, I don't care if we don't win anymore. Just pass me the ball. That about right? Ooh. You've got a real attitude. You've been on my nerves since day one. I'm going to beat you so black and blue you'll never want to show your face in my basketball club ever again. It's about time. Eh? You want to fight? What? What the hell are you doing? Hey, what's going on here? Th this, this is... Oh! <laughs> that it, it uh, drove him to drop out of school. That is so what I would do too. Um, this was just a, a society was making a fuss about bullying, so everything went relatively smoothly. I don't feel like I'd lose on a, in a one-on-one -on -one fight, but it seems wise to get in shape just in case. I might as well get familiar with fighting with weapons or learn some martial arts. There's Kimitima's place. I'm home. Both of my parents were working full-time and gone on business trips, not to mention a hands-off policy when it came to raising children. Yeah, right. Money was regularly dis deposited into my account so I could take care of myself. Mostly carbs and protein. Consume as little fat as possible and only from fish or vegetables. Um, that should do the trick. Who decided it was a good idea to drink raw eggs? <laughs> I don't think I can keep this up. I'll think of a way to cook them later. Uh, Gina is full of, of um... Of, uh, uh, sorry. Of, uh, uh Aviato. I use Jojo for one single girl. Is the director away? The head of the dojo is away on a workshop tour. I'm here in his place. How may I help you? It may just be my personality, but I seem to get in a lot of scuffles. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I'd like to learn the basics of martial arts for self-defense. Just one question for you. Is it truly possible to become a strong fighter only by following a specific form of cutting stationary objects? Let's test that theory. You may swing at me with all your strength. Don't worry, I'll stop my blow at the last moment. Hmm, I don't want to make you feel bad, but I'm a prodigy just so you know. Oh my god, this is something Brian would say! Oh my fucking god, that is something Brian would say. Um, finished already? I thought you were a prodigy. And that's something else Brian would fucking say, too. For the first time in my life, I met another genius when faced with skill and resolution. Oh, God, this is great. This is so amazing. But I'm so scared that my man's going to die. But um, chapter 57 is titled The Genius' Realization. After losing to Ayami, I continued practicing at the Genius School Dojo, the only other true genius he ever met. After mastering the basics of the practice, uh, Genai, let's have another go today. Only until my father comes home. We've begun having matches against each other un unbeknownst to uh, the school head. Normally a match this close to a real fight was forbidden. We were slowly bewitching by um, each other's talents. Uh, sorry, words like shit. We were slowly bewitched by each other's talents, and at some point our matches with wooden swords were part of our daily routine. I had confidence in my ability to learn quickly, but with a speed equal or perhaps even surpassing mine, Ayami to conti continue to... Um, Pony to move to perfection. Oh, there's my kitty. Hi, Pancake. Hey, kitty. Um, my poor kitty is traumatized, by the way, uh, by what happened. Gina, you have a natural gift. I don't need your flattery. You'll figure it out someday. During my time at the dojo, only once did I manage to score a point against Ayame, although she was more proficient than me. My point had been won due to my phys physical strength as a man. I felt an unusual bitterness despite having won the match. However... Her regret was a um, thing far more powerful because not only she not only had greater or equal skill in sword fighting, but she diligently practiced her sword strokes even after I stepped out the door. I've never cried after a loss. In the end, I had just been, uh, in the end I had been just a little more earnest that day, but deep in my heart, I wondered if I, um, I had ever taken this seriously. W what do you think you're doing? And then, since that day, I never again set foot inside the Genai School Dojo. You. You're gonna quit? Yes, I have nothing else to learn. 
What was that? You got some balls saying that. You've worked hard, Kimijima. If you'll excuse me, don't worry about him. Get back to your drills. This place is too small to contain him. Damn straight it is! All this talent I've got, and it means absolutely nothing. With no opponent worthy to stand by me, all I feel is solitude. Um, as for school life, I challenged myself to exercise my ability only when necessary. I was adequately, um, adept, um, uh, uh, at sports and an adequately good students, I could uh, ad adequately good student. I could be funny or serious at the um, appropriate moment. That was Brian. Oh my God, Kimmy Diva is Brian like to a T. Oh God, that's the part I continue to play. Hold on, my cat's being uh, causing shenanigans. Um. Uh, that's the part I continue to play. Don't you think so, Kimijima? Yeah, you're right. Oh, Kimijima. I was constantly... Oh, Kimijima. I was constantly surrounded by people. More girls start to confess their feelings in, uh, to me and invite me to go out with them. Oh, fucking cat. <laughs> um... Let's see. Hey, Kimijima, let's go to karaoke after school. Sorry, I've got my part-time um, part job today. Oh, um, you won't tell the teacher about that, will you? Um, well, I felt not the slightest stirring of interest. All you do is work, Kimijima. <laughs> I'm sorry, real uh, really, tell me next time you go. What's worse, I was feeling restless. It's only when I started going to a certain gym that I realized something. Ooh. You're about the only one in this whole gym who could take me on, to Shahide. With your build and your sense, uh, you got what it takes to go pro. I've got high hopes for you. Thank you, it's all thanks to your guidance. That man bursting with talent and highly um, ambitious and highly ambitious was to become his pillar of strength for me. It's possible that I suspected it at the time, but I didn't want to. I was uh, the genius's path is tinged with loneliness. This I am so goddamn scared right now that Kimijima is gonna is gonna die. Please don't kill him. I've already suffered enough. Please don't kill him. Anyway, I'm very curious what you guys um, thought of these chapters. Like, Kimijima is a goddamn genius. He's a prodigy. And goddamn it, it makes me think of my, my mans. It does, because my mans is the same way. Anyway, very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing, I want to help keep this uh, channel uh, going so I can keep bringing you more Abyss Rage content. There's a few ways you could do that. You could donate to my PayPal, Patreon, GoFundMe, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, find me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.